Do you know who I am? No. I don't know anything about you. You wouldn't. People like you don't. Now you're thinking, who would have it out for me, huh? A few weeks back, there might have been a station wagon in the forest, full of all sorts of food, water, nine things you need to survive. Yeah, I'm not some cannibal, Lee. Some killer out in the woods. Some villain. I'm just a dad. I coach Little League. I didn't take from you. Your people didn't? I didn't agree with it. That's what Clementine said. Why didn't you? It wasn't right. It wasn't our stuff. That's real good of you. Look, what do you want me to say? I don't want you to say anything. I want you to know what happened. Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? Hmm. Yes, of course. Who? Guy named Kinney. I hurt her. So bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. Hmm. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her. So bad. Hmm. And then we came back. And all our stuff was gone. Your people, Lee. That asshole in the ball cap. His stupid fucking wife. I could have earned her trust back if they hadn't made our situation so desperate. Sorry. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. <clears throat> they didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road. Do I look like a monster to you? We all do. Some more than others. I'm not like you. You walked a little girl into a dairy full of sick people and let them get their hands on her. I was trying to find someplace safe for her. You let a boy get yanked out of a window and into the night so you could protect a pretty girl with a gun. Oh. There. You brought her to the most dangerous place in this city where she could have died. I couldn't leave her at the house alone. She would have been better off! Alter. How could you know all this? You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so bad. Just give me Clementine back. I'd rather kill her myself. Because that's what will happen if she goes with you. After I found Clementine on my radio, I wasn't even mad at you. I was coming for the others. For revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did, 
and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. Mas? I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Natürlich. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Look, I was bitten. You were what? Yeah. I probably don't have a whole lot of time. Wow. Okay, then. You'll take care of her? We'll give her a home. Why are you saying we? Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... I'm glad, too. What? I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. Come on. Leise. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <coughs> genau. Du, lass meine Kleine in Ruhe. Nein, 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 nein. Ach du Scheiße. I I I oh, yeah. It's okay. It's okay. I You look horrible. Ach was? That's what he said. Yeah. Let's just get somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Cleo, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Gib sie ihr. Ich kann besser ziehen wie ich. <lacht> hey. You saved me. It's my fault. Everything is dangerous. Like you said. Genau das habe ich gesagt. You learn. Which way out? Through there. War so klar. Boah! Der riecht mich als einer von ihm. Mist. Yeah, I know it. 
must have. You're covered in all that gross stuff. I had to get through a bunch of them to get here. Hm. That's how we'll get out of Savannah. Ja, vielleicht können wir dich ja ein bisschen einschmieren, kleines. Auch wenn es mir nicht gefällt. Aber wir müssen. Net, guck nicht hin. Äh, tut mir echt leid, Kleines. Aber so kann ich überleben. Das haben sie übrigens in der Serie auch gemacht. <lacht> Wie sie schüttelt. Are you done? A little more. I want to be sure. Just a little more. So gross. <lacht> so süß. Wie <lacht> so süß. <lacht> There. That should do it. I hope so. And you're missing something. I thought it was gone. I thought you were gone. Thank you. <coughs> so goldy. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm-hmm. Das Walkie Talkie hätten wir auch nochmal mitnehmen können. Ich mach noch komische Geräusche. Äh. Ja, Mist. Ich kann mich noch daran erinnern, das war in der Stadt, wo sie das in der Serie mal gemacht haben. Da sind sie irgendwie auch drauf gekommen. Ging aber nicht gut aus, soweit ich mich erinnere. Ey, du Pissnalke. Verpiss dich. Was ist, was ist, was ist? Ihre Mutter und ihr Vater. Nein! Nein, schlechter Zeitpunkt, ganz schlechter Zeitpunkt. Oh nein, oh nein, oh nein. Die Kleine, bitte lass alles in Ordnung sein mit dir. Wake up! Please don't be dead. Please no. Lee, I, I was so scared. I, I, I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Come here, sweet pea. They're dead. They really are. Oh, das sieht immer schlecht aus. Wir müssen aus dem Weg raus, so schnell wie wir können. Wir können nicht. Es gibt tausende von ihnen draußen. Wir müssen. Ich werde dich beschützen. Wir werden dich durchbringen. Nein, nein, das ist krass. Ich habe dich gerettet. Wir sind sicher hier. Ich habe dich gerettet. Halt die Tür auf. Ich kann nicht. Mach es! 